Welcome to building eight Rails applications in 30 days. In this 30 day tutorial, we'll build eight very nice looking Rails applications, Tumblr, Project Management, ESPN, Instagram, TaskRabbit, HipTime, Broadway, and then a document storage application like File Cabinet. So these are all very different looking, uh, different functionalities that will teach you essentially the full breadth of Ruby on Rails in the shortest time possible. So the course itself will begin by introducing you to Rails. Why is Rails important? It's by far the most popular uh, framework for building uh, Rails uh, for building web applications very quickly. It will also uh, show you how to install Rails. There's uh, some very cool resources. Uh, there's one that I specifically advise that you look at to install Rails and all the tools you'll need. And then the style sheets will obviously need access to the style sheets to um, properly make your application styled the way it should be. And then there's the giveaway, a sublime text giveaway that is uh, open to students of this course. Uh, please take it uh, when you submit and anyone else who submits using your referral link will also enter you seven times into the competition so that you win, your chances of winning go up significantly. This is a quick optional section on Ruby. This is a Rails tutorial, but Ruby is obviously the language that we'll be using. So if you want a crash course, this is very quick. Um, you can also uh, skip it and go ahead. This is a practice round in Rails. So if you want to get uncomfortable with the environment before we actually building the application, there's a round here that will take you through essentially the entire launch process, the common commands, things of that nature. This will also introduce you to the model view controller, which is uh, obviously one of the most important concepts here that we'll be using. That we'll be using over and over again, but it just introduces it at the very beginning. And then we'll start building the applications themselves. So we'll begin with file cabinet and then Tumblr. We'll run through Instagram, the web application that is, and then hip time, which is a to-do list uh, lookalike. ESPN forum, it also looks a lot like Hacker News with uh, upvoting and then there will be a Broadway web application. This is a, essentially very similar to IMDB, but for Broadway shows. And then there's project management app and then a task rabbit or essentially a Craigslist lookalike. So these are the eight core applications. We end up, we end up at the end uh, with uh, test driven de development using a uh, mock application. And then we will also launch all of the applications I, I launch one application, but it gives you a clear instruction on how to do it for the rest of your applications as well. And we'll be launching to Heroku. So that is how we will conclude our tutorial. Uh, I will see you inside, but before we do that, there will be issues that you run into as you build your applications, common errors. Uh, the steps to take when you run into issues is first read the error, search for Google, and then ask for help. And when you search for Google, you often end up, let's say template is missing. This is a common mistake or error that we run into when we're building our applications. If you just Google it, you'll more often than not land onto a Stack Overflow page, which will look something like this, and they will almost always answer your question for you. Obviously, if they don't, uh, please leave a comment in the comment section, and I'll be more than happy to help you. I look forward to seeing you inside. Now, let's get started on this 30-day challenge.